Okay, let's have a little bit of a warm up today then. Welcome to today. Classical Pilates, always with a bit of a twist. So just standing yourselves to the front of your mat. I'm going to quickly take you through a nice warm up here of the sun salutation A and sun salutation B. So first of all, A, you're going to take an inhale and take your hands up to the ceiling. A glance up at those hands. Then you're going to take an exhale and just fold yourself forward, pressing your tummy against those legs. And then extending forward. Step it back into a plank. Just bring the knees down to the floor and lower yourself gently down, then pressing yourselves up into cobra. Tucking the toes under and pressing back as you exhale into downward dog. Breathing here, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. One more breath here and exhale. Then inhale as you glance forward to the hands and step forward with the feet back into your forward fold. And then halfway up. Forward and fold again as you exhale. Inhaling as you come right back up to the top. And then exhale as you bring the hands back to heart. Into sun salutation B now. So you're going to take an inhale and bring your hands up and sit back into chair position. That's it, looking up at those hands, taking that bottom back. Exhale as you sit down into forward fold. Inhale as you extend forward. Exhale as you fold forward, step it back into that plank. Inhale, going down to the mat up into the cobra and then exhale pressing up into downward dog adjusting your position pressing through the heels drawing the tummy muscles in deep breaths here looking back at the tummy pressing through the heels pressing through the hands that's it just center yourself here And then looking forward and just taking the knees down onto the floor, just shuffling back slightly so that you can lean forward into the puppy pose. So taking the hands out in front and feeling a lovely stretch across the back, resting the head down on the floor. Breathing here. And then bringing yourself back up to all fours into cat cow. So drawing the tummy muscles in, rounding the back up as you exhale all the air out. Then inhale as you lower the tummy, lift the head. And then exhale, reverse that stretch again. Inhale, lower the tummy, lift the head. Exhale, draw the tummy in round the back. Inhale, take it up into that neutral spine position now. Now just crossing the legs and just rolling back over those feet and taking your legs out in front. Then just crossing the legs. I'm just going to face you here now. Crossing the legs. We're just going to work into the arms a little bit now. So taking your arms out to the sides, really reaching long through those fingertips and circling the arms forward. We're just warming up those shoulders, working into the tops of the arms. Circle, circle, that's it. Even breathing here. Starting to feel those shoulders working. Then reversing. And turning the palms upwards and again circling forward. And reverse. And 
and bringing the hands down by your sides and then bringing them up to the front with the palms down, circling inwards. Just don't forget to breathe, keep your tummies pulled in. Reverse. Turning the palms upwards, circling inwards. And reverse. And then relaxing the arms down. Now taking yourself back along the length of your mat. And just taking your hands out behind you with your fingers pointing forwards, your elbows tucked in. And then we're just going to take it down. So taking the elbows back to the ground and lift. Lower and lift. So we're just working the tops of those arms a little bit more. This time we're working into the backs of those arms, into the triceps. So lower and lift. Again, keeping your tummy pulled in, remembering your posture as you, as you work through this move. Shoulders stay back and down. Tummy stays scooped. And then just taking that weight back. So you feel it in those triceps, keeping the elbows squared in. Don't let them flare out. Should we start to feel this now? That's it. Good, five more here. Just take it back, five, four, three, two and one well done okay now just rolling yourself back onto your mat nice and controlled rolling down 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 bending the knees bringing the knees into the chest bringing the chin up to the chest have a little hug in before we start just hugging knees to chest rocking side to side then keeping that chin to chest Taking the arms out to tummy height, ready for the hundred. Taking the legs to tabletop, pumping the arms up and down. Breathing in and out. Inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale. Inhale. And and exhale. Staying here but lengthening up the legs, breathing in and out. Inhale and exhale. Final breath here and exhale. Good, bring the knees into the chest, rest the head down. Take a deep breath here. Lengthen out the legs. Flex the feet, drink, bringing the toes towards the knees. Hands come up to ceiling. Chin goes to chest. Peeling up off that mat and exhaling as you reach forward. Inhaling, roll back down. Exhale, arms reach back. Hands to ceiling, chin to chest. Peeling up, drawing tummy in. Exhaling to reach. Inhaling to roll back down. Exhale, the arms reach back. Inhale, hands up, chin to chest, peeling up. Exhale, reaching it forward, rolling it back, and the arms go back. Well done, hands by your sides, just bending those knees, bringing knees into chest, lengthening legs up. Just a little reverse curl here if you can, picking the bottom up, taking the legs overhead. Lift up, lower down. Lift up, control it down. Lift up, lower down. If you can, take it a bit further with those feet and roll it down. So a little bit further and roll it down. Further still if you can, roll it back and roll it down. Roll it back. Roll it down. One more time. 
Roll it back. Roll it down. Leaving the left leg up, take the right leg down. And we're circling that leg. So take it across, down and up. Two, three, four, and five. Reverse it now. Five, four, three, two, and one. Switch legs. Taking the leg across. Five, four, three, two, and one. Reverse. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good. Bringing that leg down. Hands to ceiling, chin to chest, rolling yourself up and bringing yourself forward for rolling like a ball. Bringing the knees in, bringing the heels to the bottom, lifting the feet up off the floor, chin down to chest, tummy scooping in, and then roll it back and exhale up. Inhale back, exhale up to that balance, inhale back, exhale up. Inhale back, exhale up, two more here. One more time. Good, holding the balance now, taking a hold of the right leg, lengthening out the left, rolling yourself down onto your back, bringing that knee in towards you, pulling it in nice and strong. Single leg stretch, we're going to switch. So switch, switch 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 breathe in for two and out for two breathe in and out breathe in and out really extend beyond the toes extend and extend with that length of leg reach and reach three two one, rest the head down, hug in tight, take a deep breath. Bringing the chin back up to the chest for double leg stretch. And both arms and legs are going to reach out long. Exhale, hug in. Inhale to reach. Exhale to hug. Inhale to reach. Exhale to hug. Reach and hug. Reach and hug, reach, one more time, and hug, rest the head down, take a deep breath, scissor legs now, chin to chest, right leg up, left leg long, holding on behind that right leg, pull, 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 breathing in for two and out, for two, breathe in and out, breathe in and out, breathe in and out, final breath and out, good, hug the knees in, rest the head down, take a deep breath, then taking the hands underneath the bottom for lower lift, should be feeling those tummy muscles now. They're working hard, lengthening up those legs, taking the legs down and lift. Lower and lift. Lower and lift. Lower and lift. Lower and lift. Lower. And lift. Lower. Two more here. One more. Good. Bringing the knees into the chest. Bringing the chin up to the chest. Taking the hands behind the head and the elbows wide. Right knee in. Left leg long for crisscross. Crossing over to the bent knee. And criss. Cross. Criss. Cross. Breathing in. For two. And out. For two. Breathe in and out. Breathe in and out. 
Breathe in and out. Breathe in and out. Nearly there. Last two. Last one. Good. Rest the head down, take a deep breath. Lengthen out your legs. Take your hands to ceiling, bring your chin to chest. Roll yourself all the way up. Adjust yourself if you need to. Sitting up nice and tall. Ready for spine stretch. Hands out in front. Chin down, nose over, crown down. Reaching forward and roll back up. And again, chin down, nose, crown and reach. Roll it back up. One more time. Chin down, nose over, crown down, drawing the tummy back and reach. Rolling back up. Bringing yourself forward now for open leg rocker. Coming forward on your mat. There. Taking a hold of your ankles from the inside. Bring the feet in towards you. Let's have a little stretch here for the inner thighs first. So I want you to hold on to your feet, press outwards with your elbows and just lean forward into that stretch. That's it. Just taking a little bit of a breather here with a nice stretch before we roll it back. Always good. Always good to intersperse the activity with a little bit of a nice stretch. Okay, so coming up, taking hold of those ankles, bringing them in towards you, coming up to a balance, and taking the right leg up, and now taking the left leg up, holding that position if you can, Changing it if you need to, to the backs of the thighs instead with bent legs, it's up to you. Chin down to chest, let's roll now here. Inhale back, exhale up to balance. Inhale back, exhale up to balance. Inhale back, exhale up to balance. Two more here. Up to balance, one more up to balance. Good, hold it here, bring those legs together, roll yourself gently down, taking those hands by your sides now, ready for the corkscrew, so circle clockwise and reverse. Three lifts straight up, three, two, one. And again, circle clockwise, reverse, three lifts. Three, two, one. One more time, circle clockwise, reverse. Three lifts, three, two, one. Now taking your legs, your, your arms out into a wider position on the floor, into a T position, we're gonna just do those pendulum legs. So I want you to take your feet over to one side, not too far down, then lift back up to center. Other side and lift back up to center. Use you're using those tummy muscles. So it's side, center, inhaling over to the side, exhaling, lifting back up to center, inhaling, going over, exhaling, lifting back up to center, inhaling, going over. Exhaling, lifting back up to centre. One more time, each side to centre, other side and centre. Good. Now you're going to take your hands back down by your sides. Just have a little hug in first. We're going to do some reverse curls now, but we're going to take the bum over to the side. So we're going to lift into a curl and take it over to one side, then lift back up to centre and take it down to the other side. So again, we're working the lower abs, we're working into those sides as well. So hands can go by your sides. Lifting up. So lift and go over to the right. Lift up to center. 
swivel over to the left, lift to centre, swivel to the right, lift to centre, swivel to the left, centre and right, centre and left, centre, go right, last time, and left, good, just bring those knees in, have a little hug, take it side to side, I'm really feeling the need lately to work those lower tummy muscles. Really feeling the need. Lengthening out those legs now. Bringing hands to ceiling, chin to chest, rolling up. Just pushing yourself back into the center. In fact, let me face you again for this one because we're going into sore. We're taking the legs out into a wide position, feet flexed, hands out to the side, shoulders back and down, twisting towards that right foot, so take it around and to soar off that little toe with your little finger for three, two, one. Inhale to center, twist it round, exhale to reach. Two, three, inhale to center, twist, exhale to reach. Two, Three, inhale to center, twist and reach. Two, three, inhale to center, twist and reach. Two, three, inhale to center, twist and reach. Two, three, good, bringing the arms down, bringing the legs together, just taking the legs to one side and then bringing yourself down onto your tummy and coming up to just stretch out those tummy muscles into that sphinx pose so propped up on your elbows shoulders down making sure you've got a nice long line up the back and out up the neck and out through the top of the head and just hold that stretch there and then work the arms a little bit more today so I want you to just take your hands down either side of your chest, tuck your elbows in tight, put some lazy press ups, keeping the hips glued onto the floor, just pressing up and lower. Lift and lower. Lift and lower. And just inhale as you come up and lower it down lift and lower. keeping those elbows squeezed tightly into your sides and you start to feel this in the backs of the arms and in the lower back as well the lower back is helping out here a little bit but it's mainly the arms should be taking it and the back should be getting just a nice amount of movement through that lower back one more time Good. Propping yourselves back up again onto your elbows and bringing your two fists together in front, bring them together to make a triangle. And then just bringing the legs closer together, making sure they're glued nicely together. And kicking the right heel to bottom three times. Kick, kick, kick. Lengthen out, switch sides. Kick, kick, kick. Other side. Kick, kick, kick. Switch sides, kick, kick, kick. Still drawing that tummy off the floor as you're doing these kicks. Kick, kick, kick. Keep going. Kick, kick, kick. Final time here. Kick, kick, kick. Good, now just lay yourselves down onto your mat. Turn your head to one side. Hands down by your sides to start with. Just take a couple of breaths here. I'm being kind here today. And then after you've taken a couple of nice breaths, bringing your hands round into the small of your back, clasping one hand onto the other, gluing the legs together. Both heels will kick into the bottom three times. Kick, kick, kick. Extend the legs out. 
Lift the chest, reach the hands behind and turn to face the other way. Bring it back in again. And again, kick those feet in. One, two, three. Lengthen, lift and reach and turn to face the other way. And again, kick, 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 extend, reach back and turn to face the other way. One more time. Kick, 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 extend, reach back and turn to face the other way. Good, bringing the hands back down either side of the chest, tucking the toes, bringing yourself up to all fours. Then keeping the feet together, just take the knees apart a little bit, draw the tummy in, just sit back on the heels into rest position or child's pose. And just let the hands go forward a little bit, take the head down to the floor and take some breaths here. Just letting the back stretch. After working it with those moves. A couple more breaths here. Bringing the head up, taking yourself to sit onto your side. Okay, so we're gonna lie down. Let me just straighten out my mat a little bit here. That's it. We're gonna lie down on our side to work those legs. So just prop yourself up on your elbow or just go down onto outstretched arm. Pick up both the legs and bring them forward to that top corner of the mat. Before we start lifting that top leg, I just want you to lift both legs up. Hold that position and then lower back down. So you feel you're activating the waist as well here. And again, lift and hold. And bring it back down. One more time, lift and hold. And bring it back down. Now with that top leg, we're going to lift and lower. So point up, flex down. Point and flex. Point and flex. Point and flex. Point and flex. Four more here. Last three. Last two, last one. Good, now let's circle that leg. Nice big circles, take it forward. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, now reverse it for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Good. Bend that front, bend that top knee, bring it down in front, lift up the lower leg, activate the inner thigh. Lifting here, 10, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Circle forward, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Reverse it, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, Five, four, three, two, one. Good. Bring the legs together, roll round onto your tummy. Keep the legs lifted in the back there, working the back to those legs. Let's open and close the legs for ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Lower down. Lift back up and again, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 
four, three, two, one. Bring yourself up, bring your legs in, cross your legs, roll back over the legs and take them out to the other side. In your straight line along the back of your mat, bring yourself into your pike. So before we go into that, that hot top leg lift, we're gonna lift both legs up here. So lift and lower, really squeezing as you lift and lower. One more time, squeeze and lower. Now the top leg is lifting, point up, flex down. Point and flex, point and flex, point and flex. Nearly there, it's going four, three, two, and one. Now those big circles forward, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Now reverse it, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Now bending that top leg, taking it down in front, lifting up the lower leg to work the inner thigh and lifting here, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Circle it forward. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Reverse it. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good. Okay, now bringing yourselves up so that your legs are still out to the side. Or if you want to, changing into a cross-legged position for a stretch down the side of the body. So taking one arm up, gluing it to the side of the head. So if you've got your legs out to the side, you need it to be the opposite arm. So you, as you come over, you make a curly C with your body hold on to that top leg but if you've got your legs crossed obviously it doesn't matter you're not going to make that curly C so you're just stretching over and reaching so you feel a stretch down the side of the body you hold that stretch just take a few breaths here in that stretch reach and lengthen good you should really feel it down the side body then come up to the top and we're going to take our legs right round to the other side. Take the arm up, glue it to the head, stretch over and then extend up through the side of that body, really reaching up through the fingertips. Nice long line. Breathing into that stretch. That's really good. Then coming back up to the center. Now just taking the legs out in front. Bringing the hands into a prayer position, a spine twist, taking the shoulders back and down, and then just twisting around to one side, inhaling to the center. Really from the waist, this twist. Twist it round and center. Exhale as you twist, inhale to the center. Exhale as you twist, inhale to the center. Exhale as you twist, inhale to the center. Exhale as you twist, one more time each side. Twist, 
and center, twist and center. Stay here now, I want you to just bend the right knee in. We're gonna do that twist to the side. So you're gonna take a hold of that right leg with the left hand and then just taking the right hand behind. So really lift and hug that leg, lift up out of the waist and try and look behind you. And if you want to, you can take this arm and you can bring it right in front to just leave her there and get a bigger stretch, making sure the back shoulder stays down as you lift up out of the waist. Inhale to extend up and then exhale to twist a little bit more. And then inhale and exhale, come out of the twist. Switch the legs bringing the other foot in. Again, just starting with your hug, lifting up out of the waist as you inhale and then exhaling to get a twist. And just do that every inhale. Inhale is the lift, exhale is to twist a little bit further. And then you can, if you want to, just taking that arm, just using it to lever, to increase the stretch. Draw the tummy muscles in to really make space for the twist. A lovely twist for the back. Really good. And coming back round into centre. Good, I'm making that diamond with the feet. So feet together, knees apart. And leaning forward for that stretch. Breathing into the stretch here. And taking the legs out into a wide position. Lifting up out of the waist, turning to the right side and stretching forward. And then coming back to center and round to the other side, looking up out of the waist and then stretching forward. Breathing. Then coming back to the center. And now just taking yourselves round again to the lengthways on your mat. Sitting up nice and tall, we're gonna go for a couple of boomerangs here. So sitting up nice and tall, taking right leg over left. You're going to roll it all the way back, then crisscross those legs, come up into that teaser V, and then hands back, chin down lower. Okay, so I'll talk you through it. Hopefully you can remember. So roll it back, crisscross those legs, roll up to V. Reach behind. Chin down, legs down, and reach it forward. And again, sitting up tall, rolling back. Crisscross the legs, up to the V. Reach back. Chin down, legs down, reach forward. And again, sitting up, roll back. Cross legs, up to V. Reach back. Chin down, legs down, and reach. One more time, sitting up, roll back. Cross legs, up to V. Reach back, chin down, legs down, and reach. Good, now bring yourself forward a little bit on your mat. We're gonna go for the seal. So bring the feet in towards you. The hands come into centre, they dive through the legs and hold onto your ankles from the outside. You bring the legs in towards you, you come up into the balance position. So up on those sit bones, tummy pulled in. Then we clap the feet three times, one, two, three. Inhale to roll back, clap those feet. Exhale up, clap those feet. Inhale back, clap those feet. Exhale up, clap those feet. 
Inhale back, clap those feet. Exhale up. Now, if you can, after the next couple, come straight up to standing to so give yourself a little bit of a roll up. But if you can't manage that, just stop at the top and just help yourself up. That's fine, however you need to get up. So standing nice and tall on your mat, bringing your heels together, your toes apart in Pilates stance, really wrapping those thighs around, drawing in the tummy muscles and belly button going right back to the spine, shoulders down. Take an inhale, come up on those tippy toes, reaching tall. And as you exhale, come down, 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 and bring those heels down. Well done, folks. Well done. Thank you very, very much.